allow me take this opportunity to welcome you back to this other session of ours uh, by the name I'm called teacher Mike and I'm going to take you through element of construct 2 so if you missed out that video please first go and watch that video and even look at the first example we did for element of construct 2 and then you come for this other video because in those actually in those videos we talked about that element of construct 2 basically uh, they require coordination and when, talk, when I talk about coordination you know chemical coordination hormonal and nervous uh, in today's item actually we are going to help you uh, to show you how you can break it down you need biology for specifically item 2 uh, we are also going to let you know how uh, how you can approach item 2 questions uh, we shall also teach you how you can structure your answers and uh, maximize you need max for biology as we as we as you prepare for this final final touches uh, now as i told you in those previous videos that item two mainly looks at what coordination as you can see and now we have another scenario there item two uh, let's read it together now item two they are saying uh, on her way back home from school joanie encountered a snake screamed jumped and ran away for her life until she reached home until she reached where home now on arrival at home on arrival at home uh, the concerned mother asked her what was the problem but Joan could not talk because she was breathing heavily and felt a lot of pain in her legs. Now, this item is similar to the previous item uh, we have solved in those video clips up there. But now, because in those, in those previous lessons, I told you that in coordination, what they specify on, uh, there is that one of seeing the organ of the uh, actual those organs the eye uh, they can talk about the ear and uh, they can also talk about what somebody touching a hot object they can tell you in a scenario that somebody maybe stepped on a pin uh -huh. now let's come back to this question they are saying joan encountered a snake what does it mean? Hmm? Now this question means that Joan saw a snake. You get? Now after identifying the, 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 the organ which the question wants you to talk about, the, the, the what? Uh, the answering becomes very what? Very simple. For example, let's go for let's go to the task. They are saying task uh, Roman number A here they are saying explain the laws of the body structures involved in the in this situation now what you should know here when they say explain the roles of the body structures involved in this situation is different from the other question which shows which says like describe hmm? how the body coordinated when you meet such question, when they are telling you to describe how the body coordinated, there you talk about the processes. You get that right that light rays from the snake entered the eye. Now, this question is different. So to a person, uh, to a student who described here. Actually, the, you, 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 they were about to give you, you qualify to get an NA. Because the, here, description is not what? It's not required. The question is very simple. They are saying, explain 
the roles of the body structure as you can see there explain uh, the roles of the body structure involved in this situation now when you meet such a question just go after understanding the organ that it is all about the eye then talk about those structures hmm? for example you have told us here that the eye saw the snake now because they are saying explaining the roles now the eye becomes the body structure then what is the importance of that body structure is for vision seeing or image what image formation enough there you qualify to get a, a ue now ue means you have understood uh, the structure and really you have what you have explained now after there there are very many structures you can talk about the eye then secondly you can also talk about the adrenal what the adrenal gland as a structure now what does the adrenal gland do we all know that adrenal gland secretes what we are calling adrenal hormone now you are giving the structure and the, its function or oh, its what its role there you get the ue that means you have understood the structure and you have explained its what its role uh, the other one we can talk about is the muscles muscles in the legs uh, now these muscles contract enabling her to do what enabling her to run it has still you score a ue then we have also what we are calling the lungs carried out gaseous exchange uh, now for what for respiration the lungs are structures and the role of the lungs is to carry out gaseous what gaseous exchange for respiration there you get ue but when somebody just writes and say lungs without the explanation you get ul that means you have understood the structure but you listed then the other structure which is also involved is called the what the heart as you can see there now what is the role of the heart the heart mm, pumped oxygenated blood to muscles for energy production and the respiration then you have also another structure which is called the brain now the brain coordinated uh, different activities or we can see or uh, as you can see there or you can say that the brain actually interprets or it is used for interpret what? interpretation of hmm, the impulses which are sent then from there uh, we can also talk about uh, another one another another structure which is the optical nerves now these optical nerves send or they are the ones which transmit or carry impulses to the what to the brain then another one we have what we call the motor neuron we have what we are calling motor neuron these ones they are the ones which carry or they transmit impulses to the adrenal gland as you can see so when you write uh, your answers like that uh, just expect maximum what maximum scores but now you have to read the question and the underline you have to analyze before you begin pouring their data now when they say explain the role of the structures involved in the what in the situation like what we saw in our scenario that uh, Joan encountered the what a snake obviously you, you, you don't write there the procedure or the, the, the description of the whole process now they are saying explain the role of the organ the role of the structures now you give the structures what was the role of the eye in the scenario mm -hmm. from the eye what was the role of the brain what is the role of the muscles in the legs what is the role of the adrenal gland? You get. So that one is different from the other one we talked about. So this is another version of item what? 
item tu i said we are preparing for the what uh, for the final these are some of our last tips so don't miss out please share and send to a friend subscribe for more videos like this one uh -huh. now from there let's look at part b because in the other element of construct i told you that these numbers for section a they always have a b and what and c so let's proceed to part what part b now they are saying explain uh explain the physiological changes in her body leading to heavy breathing and feeling pain and feeling of pain in her heart in her legs as you can see there now what causes heavy breathing here very many people or very many candidates uh, who did this paper most of them failed because some of them were like our teachers not teach us the physiological changes but when you look at this question it was extracted from respiration which is senior three work now they are saying explain the physiological changes in her body leading to the heavy breathing and the feeling pain now you have to look at heavy breathing mm -hmm. uh, actually if you remember respiration what causes heavy breathing remember joan was running uh, somebody can say joan maybe what caused the heavy breathing is uh, somebody can say uh, you can talk about what that maybe joan had the low or limited what oxygen yeah it is the one which causes heavy breathing because joan had to breathe a lot in order to take in more what oxygen you can base on that and say uh, maybe joan had the uh, joan was experiencing heavy breathing because uh, she was having limited what limited the oxygen now you all know that uh, what causes pain in legs uh, if you remember respiration we talked about uh, uh, accumulation of carbon dioxide in the body or you can talk about accumulation of lactic what lactic acid in the muscles and one which causes pain and fa fatigue okay let's begin with the uh, with the feeling feeling of pain in her legs uh -huh, we are saying we on this point that prolonged learning led to production and accumulation of lactic acid in muscles they are the ones which causes what which causes pain now in this area remember uh, you we are looking for only ue not ua because i said earlier that ue means somebody has understood the physiological changes and went ahead and do what explained there you get all your scores now now what caused the heavy what heavy breathing is this they are saying this this is the part that prolonged learning uh, reduces the amount of oxygen in the what in the body so uh john so the joan breathed heavily uh to take in more or extra oxygen to be broken to be broken down uh, or accumulated or produced lactic acid or remove carbon what carbon dioxide so joanne received the uh, re actually it was due to reduced amount of oxygen in the body so joanne had to breathe heavily in order maybe to to, to take any more oxygen which can eh, break eh, the accumulation of lactic what lactic acid uh, i hope now here the only challenge is you have to identify that physiological change and explain you get uh -huh. then from there cause in biology we believe that the more you write is the more you fail uh, look at how we marked this uh, so we are saying if somebody gets eight or more you is you give six and if somebody gets five to seven you e you give what five i told you what you e means so from there uh, allow me take you through 
uh, the last part of the question where they said uh, suggest how Joan was able to recover from her conditions with the time now without wasting time let's go for the first point uh, we are saying Joan rested after resting this limiting or reducing energy demands in her body such that extra oxygen taken in enable the breakdown of lactic acid or remove or remove of carbon dioxide in order to repair the what the muscles uh, then it two we can say joan rested reducing at the level of adrenaline hormone in the body hence restoring no more what no more physiological functions uh, or reducing the effect of adrenaline now the other one we can say joan stretched her legs just for easing muscle tightness or we can talk about blood what bloody blood saturation as you can see there uh, now uh, social isolation or stigma or discrimination uh, due to violation of the cultural social norms and the values then you have also what you are calling uh, okay allow me end here I wish you the best. Please subscribe forward as we prepare for your neighbor. Thank you.